Welcome back to some Ark Valgaro. Today we have a little bit of stuff planned for a kibble farm. Uh, the guy behind me there, little Orviraptor. We need to uh, capture him. And we're going to run back to base to tame him. I got some eggs on me. A uh, Giga, a Rex, and a Berry. Just some ones that I've picked up um, over the past couple days. We're going to tame him up. And probably going to do just basic kibble. It's the easiest one and the cheapest. I'm wanting to to do that for the next boss fight, for the alpha. Um, the pig, we had problems with. You can't feed him food fast enough, and he keeps running out. So, the the kibble, there's no cooldown on the on the feeding time for him. So if I put basic kibble in there, it'll uh, it'll be a lot easier to, uh, to keep his health up for, uh, or not his health, but his food up for healing. So, in order to do that, we'll get a kibble farm going. Probably gonna use Lystros, just because it's either those or dodos, and man, I tell you what, having a bunch of dodos that close to the base, dude, I couldn't stand a sound. So we're gonna get this guy back to base, get him knocked out. I think I have to use clubs. I think uh, his health is so low, I think a trank might kill him. So we'll, we'll use the clubs. I got two of them made up. That's the plan for today. Get him tamed, get a couple more lystros, and build a small little room for a kibble farm. All right, drop him in this little pin that we got over here. Nice. Question is, do I need a bowl? I'll probably still bowl of him just, just to be safe. I didn't even see what level he was. Come on, dude. Take a nap. Dang, I didn't think I was going to take that many. Oh, we got loose. Not that it matters, but... Dude, don't tell me I have to go repair these things. Nice. Woo. So he is always oh, a level ninety. That's why. Okay. 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 Let's give him the uh, the Giga. I uh, would we'll just throw all three in there. I don't know which one he prefers. I think he prefers the Giga. But we'll let him. Uh, we'll let him tame up. I don't think level matters with them. Could be wrong. Never tamed one before. Let's go ahead and get rid of this other stuff real quick. And then while he's doing that, uh, I was thinking about putting it, busting out a little little hole in the wall there, moving these guys. I might cryopod them. They're just taking up space at this point. But uh, I might add on the little room right here on the side. That way everything's still kind of contained. Easy to get to, out of the way. And yeah, I think I'll, uh, what is he? Okay, it is a, it is a he. I'm thinking maybe... Uh, Maybe two males and probably a total of uh, 10 or 15 females to lay the eggs. I don't know. I've never really done a kibble farm, so I'm kind of kind of new to the whole process. But first things first, we'll hit, let him tame up, and I'm going to start getting some, uh, some ceilings and stuff together. I think I might have some already made up. Yeah, I do. And I'll need some pillars, which I have plenty of. All right, so I'm going to start getting a floor built over there, and we'll let him team, and then we'll be back. Nice, nice. So he did take the one giga egg. Awesome. So we'll let you off a of follow. Keep him in there for right now. I got the base foundation set up for, I think, how I want to do it. Let's get rid of these eggs and stuff real quick. Just so we don't have them on us and spoil. So here's what we have. I need to uh, need to close this in down here. I think they should be big enough. Like I said, I'll put the Orvaraptor kind of in the middle here, and then um, 
probably bring two males in because uh, I think the mate boost also helps them with the egg production. So we could get him to follow. Let's put him on close follow. Whoops. All right, buddy. Dude, I didn't think about the noise that he's going to be making. Let's get you right here close to the center. Awesome, awesome. I'm not sure about the doorway. I hate these these short doors. But I was thinking about putting uh, probably one row of stone wall and then the rest glass. That way they uh, get a little bit of daylight coming in. I think I have some walls already made up too. I sure do. We're done with those. And I think we're done with the ceilings. Ah, oh, you know what? I'm going to have to make some more greenhouse walls. Not exactly sure how, how high I want to go with this. Probably not too much, because man, that glass is expensive. So I need one, I need three more, and then maybe I'll just do a slope up to there. That'd be pretty neat, kind of an end piece. So three regulars, and then start some slopes. Uh, what am I out of? Ah, oh, cementing piece, I tell you what, man. Yeah, we're pretty low on that. I'm gonna have to get some more made up with the... with the chitin. And then... Is so it gonna do slope all the way up? I don't know. Let's make a couple. Maybe I'll just go one high on the slope and then straight over to the wall. Oh, I forgot I need the other pieces. Dude! I tell you what, building an arc. I'm going to have to make some chitin. I'll make some, uh, some mini pace with my chitin. I just got my stock back up from uh, <laughs> using it all last time to make uh, some mini base. Those beavers, man, they're just... I need to put another little base up there. See, here's the part I get mixed up to. The right and the lefts. I mean, it should be self-explanatory, but holy crap is it not. So I have to pay attention to what I put down. I might... I think I only go one high anyway, so... Shouldn't matter. Tell you what, let's go ahead and go one more high. One more and then we'll do the, the crossover. Alright, let's see where we're at. Dude's in the way! I might have to put some lights out here too for him. Well, it'll be nice to have this. At least it'll uh, help out quite a bit. I might have to go up top or take the uh, the bird up to get to those. Yeah, we can reach it.
Awesome. So I, I want to get some lights too. So I didn't put any. Dang it, I didn't put any. Um. Ah, uh, what do you call it? The uh, cable underneath. Awesome. Nice little uh, kibble room. Shouldn't make this in my greenhouse, man. Instead of having it on the roof. <laughs> Dude, you're like in the way, man. Back it up. And then let's go ahead. Nah, we'll go down around the side. Need to bust a hole in the wall. Because I did destroy, I think, the one that was right here. Right? Dude, I hate placing these, man. Tell you what. Might need to do this from up top. Well, that was totally the wrong one! Yeah, see, that thing didn't even place in the right spot anyways. Did it? <laughs> Parkour fail! Tell you what, I just need to do ceilings as I go. Oh, I hate destroying everything just to do that, but... My gosh, are you serious, dude? Oh man, I tell you what. All so that they can have some light. I tell you what, man. Well, I'm glad I didn't bust all of these out. I'm hoping that <laughs> hoping those went in the right spots. Oh, they did. Awesome. Okay. I usually put these on medium. High just is like it blinds you, man. Yeah, I know, man. You just you just shut your mouth over there. Don't need to hear it. Alright, well, let's see. At least I only need one wall. One wall and one wall. Dude, if that whole ceiling would have fell. Oh, man. <laughs> it's been a bad day. Awesome. So there we go, man. We have it all set up at least. It'll be, uh, it'll be nice for him. I'll probably... I don't know if this is big enough. Yeah, it's big enough. Should be fine. I don't think anything's gonna be right there. I'll just make sure not to put them on that last corner whenever I bring them in here. Alright, well I think we're set up pretty well here. I've got two males in here and the rest are females. I think for the rest I'm gonna just end up uh, using some of the eggs and hatching instead of going out and trying to uh, to tame them because it's kind of hard to find some of them. I got all these from the uh, the beach over there, but I couldn't find any more. So as you can see they have the bonuses from the uh, Orviraptor. Little eggs flashing over their head. You gotta have him on uh, wandering, but I just went ahead and weighed him down with some uh, some stone so he can't move around. That way he's uh, kind of locked into that central location. And that's it though. We'll get, uh, we'll probably get about 10 total of the females, and then that'll be enough for producing eggs, and we'll just 
work on it as we're uh, getting all the other stuff ready for the, the alpha boss. But it turned out to be a pretty nice build. I kind of like it. Just tucked away in the side over here. However, we're going to go ahead and leave this one here. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.